Luz y Progreso, Honor and Respects. This is Sancista Brujo Luis. So today the mail came in. And here's the envelope. I just opened the mail and I was like, wait, wait a second. I didn't order any books online, so I was kind of confused. And then I opened it up and here was this uh, book. And I was like, oh, wow, I forgot all about it. Uh, I haven't even read it yet. I just opened it. And I just want to show you. It is uh, by Ellen Everett Hopman, forward by Judica Iles, a lovely woman. I love her books. I love all her works. Look at the cover. It's a really nice cover. It's titled The Real Witches of New England, History, Lore, and Modern Practices. Here's the back. There's no picture or anything, just an explanation of the book. And here's a side. The Real Witches of New England, and the book company that publishes it. Now, you might have heard of Ellen Everett Hopman because she's also published various books on Druidism, on Paganism, on Witchcraft. All her books on Amazon.com have a four and a half, five point rating. The people just love her books. Uh, they're really highly recommended. Uh, people just give them great reviews. Sally, know, Sally to say the only book that I own of her is this one which is uh, Secret Medicines from Your Garden, Plants for Healing, Spirituality, and Magic by Ellen Everett Hopman. In the back, there's a picture of the late of, of Ellen. Like I said, all her books are... I've, I've only read the Sally to say this one, but they, they, have, they receive great reviews. And like I said, most of her books are on herbalism, druid, druidism, Paganism, uh, witchcraft, and uh, this was, a, I like this, I love this book actually, I like it a lot. Uh, one thing about this book that I really enjoy, well this one on the, on the herbalism, is the color palettes, or the color pictures, uh, let me see if I can find one, or any, there you go, I love that. another page with more herbs so Sally Sally say I don't own many books by Ellen Everett Hopman except for this one I picked this one up at a, at a bookstore and I just wanted to read it funny that when I had purchased this book around the time that I had purchased this book here's some more pictures I love I love books that have uh, color pictures like that. But anyways, but around the time that I purchased this book, I had gotten an email by Judica Iles, and if you don't own any of Judica Iles' books, I highly recommend them. They're great books. She emailed me, and she said that Ellen uh, Everett Hopman was doing a, a book on interviewing witches that resided and lived within New England. Uh, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, uh, New Hampshire, and Vermont, maybe Maine. Uh, and she asked me if I was interested in being interviewed for the book. And I said, sure, I, I, would, I would love that. They wanted to get a, you know, different cultures within the book. Uh, and she asked me if I knew anybody, so I also recommended Terry, partner Terry. So let me show you something, but here it is, The Real Witches of New England. Kind of reminds me of uh, The Real Housewives of, The Real Housewives franchise of Bravo. Now this book is 380 pages. Uh, there's the context, I have not read it yet. Okay, a forward by Judica Iles. Uh, Druids, Witches, and the Birth of this book. History of Witch Persecutions. And interviews with witches of New England. 
So this book is good. It's a lot of there's Christian Day. There's a uh, Christopher Penzac. And let's see. And over here, page two ninety seven, Sancista Brujo Luis. And there's Terry. 238. Now, again, I have not even read this book. I just got it in the mail. And there I am. There's my picture. Sancista. There's my. Uh... There I am. And Terry is. Where's Terry? Here he is. There's Terry. Now, we both were interviewed for the book, and our interviews were accepted. Again, I have not even read the book. It's 20 pages is the book. Uh, 380 so I'm gonna read it Terry's gonna read it and I'm just ha happy that we both made it into this book there's Terry right there I love that picture great picture uh, you know they were they, you know Judica you know was wondering if she, we can get people of various cultures so T Terry and I made it again I have not read the book um, so I'm going to check it out tonight, give it a good reading, and give you my thoughts there, Sancista Brujo Luis, give you my thoughts on it after I read it. But it's jam-packed with interviews by witches of New England, which constitutes a Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, New Hampshire, and Maine. So anyways, I'm going to read this tonight. Give it a good reading. It's Christopher. Yep, that's Christopher Penzak. I'm going to give this a good reading tonight, and uh, I'm sure I'm going to love it. <laughs> I know what I said for the interview. I can't uh, do a recommendation because I haven't even read it yet. So it's just a book review, I guess I'm going to say. I'm going to read it tonight. So anyways, the book is titled... The Real Witches of New England by Ellen Everett Hopman, forward by Judica Iles. And there's the book. I'm going to give it a good reading tonight. And I'll come back in the second part of this video with my last thoughts. It just came out uh, this month, September 2018. The Real Witches of New England. So I gave it a quick reading. And I don't want to spoil too much, but the book is really good. I actually enjoyed it a lot. I love the interviews and the different perspectives that each witch and practitioner has. There's a forward by uh, Judica Iles. Love her. I love that, that, that image. Love Judica Iles. If you don't have any books by Judica Iles, I definitely recommend go checking it out. Uh, there's Ellen right there. I'm sorry, that's Judica Iles right there. I'm sorry about that. Uh, preference, uh, Druids, Witches, and the Birth of this Book. I think this is written by Ellen. Pretty sure. Yes, it is. What I like about this book, it is, here's the history of the witch persecutions, at least within New England. And have got beautiful pictures. Um throughout the book of uh, the persecutions of witches within New England, like the Salem witch trials and so on. What I love about this book is the different perspectives that you... I love the pictures. There's pictures throughout the book, especially pictures of each of the, the, the witches that were interviewed. And again, this came out for September, what is it, September 2018. I don't want to show too much, but I definitely highly recommend grabbing this book. I was thinking it was going to come out in October, and it would have been part of my Season of the Witch, which I always do every October, Season of the Witch uh, videos. But it came out early. So I don't want to spoil too much, uh, but the book is good. 
there are 34 witches interviewed within this book most of them are from new england uh, some have moved on to other parts of the united states which is perspective from all cultures terry is japanese cuban i uh, japanese and cuban i am puerto rican uh so you have witches that are Asians within this book, Native American witches, uh, Italian witches, there I am, Italian witches, Caucasian witches, uh, I'm trying to get more pictures, that was myself, San Cisto, but who is, you know, it's an honor to be in a book of, some of these people I, I know and have published other works, and they have other books out, so it's an honor uh, to be in a, book with you know people that I've actually read before or that, that I've heard of before so the interviews are great you get a different perspective from you know culture to culture or from tradition to tradition tradition to to, to tradition sorry about that uh, and that's one thing that I enjoy about that that's uh, Christopher Penzak uh, one thing I enjoyed about this book, okay? I don't want to give too much away from it. There's Christian Day, right there. Like I said, there are 34 witches within this volume, within this book. And again, it is titled, a, well, first of all, uh, Ellen Everett Hopman, forward by Judica Iles, The Real Witches of New England. A lot of people ask me, have I ever published a book? Actually, I have. Uh, one of my first books that I ever published, well, first of all, this one is an English book by uh, Paula Mambo Weather, and I translated, which is no longer in print, sadly to say, uh, I Bobo, the Spanish version by Sancista Brujo Luis. I translated this book into Spanish for her, and... Uh, let me show you where am I? This book here. Okay. And I also published a book. A lot of people ask me, will you ever this is more on Puerto Rican Espiritismo, Puerto Rican Spiritism, Luz y Progreso, Light and Progress. Uh, a handbook of the development of Puerto Rican Spiritism by Sancista Brujo Luis. This is my book. Um uh, Came out a few years ago, and it's time that I, I get to work on a new book. A new book. Need to publish a new book. And most of the book is in English, except for the prayers are in Spanish. Okay, but this is an awesome book. I recommend it. Sorry, I was just plugging myself, but I recommend this book. Go pick it up. It's a real good book. Uh, the season of the witch. Halloween's coming up, and it's gonna be a fun book to read. You know, get different perspectives of witches within uh, New England and their various traditions. Right now, at the moment of this of the shooting of this video, this book is what seventeen forty nine at Amazon dot com. Go get it real quick. Uh, seventeen forty nine is a really good steal. Uh, I think the book regularly is twenty dollars or twenty four ninety nine. Not sure. Go check out on Amazon dot com. The title again is "The Real Witches of New England." Recommend it. Great book. I'm going to cut this video short. I don't want to spoil them too much on the book. Sancista Brujo Luis. And also go check out my book if you have not. Luz of Progreso, Light and Progress, a handbook on spiritism. This is Sancista Brujo Luis, Santo Sanse. Go check it out. The Real Witches of New England. Hit that like, uh, hit that like button. Smash that uh, notification button to get notifications when I have future videos out. Uh, leave a comment down below. Any suggestions of future videos? I will try to answer each uh, each uh, comment down. I always try to answer as many comments as I can. But again, check out this book, The Real Witches of New England. This is Sancista Brujo Luis. Have a great night. Santo Sanse.